Hey, this is Coach Phillips, the men's coach at Montana State University. Uh, we have a great program here. It's a medium-sized school with 12,000 students, so there's a lot of individual attention for our student athletes. Our team, we only have eight guys on the team, so everybody gets a lot of individual attention. Everyone travels, everyone plays, and we just have a great, tight team unit. Although our main goal for the team is to help them succeed academically and play the best tennis of their life, we have a bigger goal and that's one for them to have the best time of their life playing college tennis here, to be a part of a team and part of a family. It's a great atmosphere. We have a lot of alumni that choose to stay here and, and work in Bozeman because it's such a beautiful place to live. The tennis facility at Montana State is outstanding. Uh, we have eight outdoor courts all resurfaced every three to four years, four indoor courts that we have priority of use and uh, of course it's surrounded by Bozeman, Montana and the ski area and the mountains so it's a beautiful setting. Uh, right next to the tennis facility we have the locker rooms where guys can leave their stuff and walk to class. Right across the parking lot is the weight room. So everything's close, convenient, and uh, really state of the art. So we're very lucky to have that. It was donated by Marsha Anderson. And the good thing about it is it's open to the public, which is rare for college campuses. Um, so we have a full junior program and an outstanding adult program. The courts are full all day long when the team's not using it. And all those same people know the team and interact with the team and come and watch the team play. So we have a great fan base for uh, exciting home matches. Our indoor facility is the only college facility in Montana and one of the only ones at the Big Sky Conference and one of the best indoor-outdoor facilities in the entire West Coast. So people come here from all around the Intermountain to play tournaments and leagues and just to practice and of course it's great for our college team. Practice is the best part of the day for me and the team and, and the, my favorite part of, of our program. Um, we design our practices with a lot of structure and we work hard and we want to play the best we can, but practices are designed for fun, so I hope when the team comes out, uh, they know that's going to be the best part of their day. Practice is always structured based on what we need to work on, how soon matches are coming up, and just as importantly, what the guys tell me they want to work on. So sometimes we practice and we have more match play before tournaments, but also we have a lot of structure with pressure training and match situations to get the guys ready for the matches. So when we go out and play matches, all we need to do is relax and have fun. Depending on the time of the year and when we have matches coming up, we always focus on something different. If we don't have a match for a few days, we have what I call a blue collar day, where we just get a good rhythm, work hard, work on our movement and consistency. As we get closer to matches, we do what I call pressure training, where we really put pressure on the guys to um, get ready for matches in real match situations, so that when we get to a match, we can just relax and have fun. Um, and then lastly, of course, we get a lot of match play and singles and doubles, so we're ready for the, for the tough matches. Uh, but the most important thing is we build a lot of fun into the practices. We play games, we have a lot of variety, so every day the guys are looking forward to getting out to the courts. Home matches at the Bobcat Tennis Center are, are always a big highlight for the year. Because our tennis facility is open to the public, our community knows the whole tennis team. So all the juniors and adults that play tennis come watch, and we have one of the biggest fan bases in the big sky and for sure even the west coast. So home matches have a lot of energy and a lot of times they're standing room only. We've had a really exciting last five years at Montana State as far as our level and rankings. Um, three of the last five years we've won our Big Sky Conference and had an appearance at the NCAA National Championships. We've also had uh, a couple individuals make it individually to the NCAA National Championships, both in singles and doubles, and uh, beat some of the top ranked teams in the country. So it's been fun for a small school to get stick our neck out there and have some great success on the court as well as having a great team atmosphere and a great family atmosphere. Bozeman, Montana is a really cool place and a, a lot of uh, student athletes come here just because of the location. I actually call Bozeman the black hole because it seems like 
when people move here for school, they never leave. Um, we have about seven or eight alumni in town that just didn't want to leave when they graduated. One thing about Bozeman is there's a lot of uh, outdoor rec activities. You can mountain bike, fish, float the river, hike. Um, we have world-class skiing, and then of course, just an hour away is uh, Yellowstone. So it's a really fun place to be, and there's a lot of, of uh, additional recreational things to do. Bozeman is a nice-sized town of about 35,000 people. And uh, it's a great community, it's a college community, it's also an agriculture community, and it's also a little bit of a tourist community. So we have great skiing and great restaurants and galleries downtown, and it's just a great little ski town. My goal as a coach when players come here is, of course, to have them get their college degree and excel in the classroom, but also to play their best tennis and challenge them to improve every day. But most importantly, I just want them to have the best time of their life playing college tennis here and be ready when they do graduate to go into the real world with a lot of confidence and uh, a great experience behind them.